So many candidates, so many topics, so little time. That would be a way to sum up the forum Thursday night for Penticton City Council candidates. For the six council spots, there are a staggering 24 people running, which is more than any other Southern Interior municipality. 23 of those council candidates took part in a two and a half hour forum Thursday, which nevertheless was attended by hundreds of constituents. Unlike Wednesday night's Mayor's Forum, though, where candidates had more opportunity to debate, the sheer number of council candidates prevented that kind of back and forth. But attendees said that hearing candidates present themselves helped them narrow their vote somewhat. I, I have one person that I'm voting for, and I have a, a few no's on my list, and a lot of maybes. It's, it's quite confusing, actually. There's, there's an awful lot of candidates running for a few uh, spots. There's a, just a lot of information to try to decipher, to make a pick on who you're going to go for. I think there's still more to learn. You, you can't make your decision just on tonight alone. You have to do a bit more research and get to know the candidates, but uh, we're fortunate to have uh, such a choice, for sure. The panel of journalists shooting questions had current and former members of council answer on concerns from their political history. Meanwhile, many new faces were asked on their positions on various issues and current events affecting the city. And like Wednesday's mayoral debate, social issues were a dominating theme during Thursday's forum. But some spectators were concerned that more diverse issues weren't addressed, one of those being zoning for retail cannabis in the city, which wasn't mentioned at any point. What everybody's talking about is the homeless and drugs and you know some, some big problems that are in the city, but there's more to running the city than just those few problems. Council candidates will take part in two other forums early in October, ahead of the October 20th election date. For Castanet News, I'm Colton Davies in Penticton.